Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valencia and you're watching Styling with V. And today's edition is gonna be more of a vlog. Um, I wanna show you a little bit more about me. I wanna show you um, how my life consists of a day off for me. I work in a hospital as a therapist and I mostly work six days a week. I work a whole lot. And on my days off, I usually try to produce content. But today I want to do a vlog because I need to go to the mall to see what's missing in my wardrobe. I've already been in my closet to see what's missing, but I want to see what new pieces and stuff that they have out at the mall. As I come back from the gym, I want to wash this crusty hair. It looks so flaky. And that's what we're gonna do today um i'm gonna have to call an uber my car's getting service so i want you to come along with me today through washing my hair and my legs were like noodles so I'm going to tackle this hair um I shampooed it with this but can you give me recommendations for something else because this is not very moisturizing it feel like it strips my hair and I just use natural hair products on my hair but today, I think I'm just going to do something quick with my hair, probably like um, a two flat twist and pin it up just to be out the way, trying on clothes. I don't have to worry about my hair frizzing up too bad. So, and I don't want to put, have to put all that gel back in my hair just to lay it down. So let's get started with this hair. You don't find cause you got me I don't wanna break your little bubble But you gotta wake up to reality Cause I can see in your eyes Your head is full of Okay, now I'm getting ready to put on my makeup But I'm indecisive Um, I wanna try I wanna try this one again The last time I tried it was too light It is got you deep three and i really love this house lab and i got my shade in uh 5 30 deep neutral and i really like this but only problem with this one is it is a hydrating foundation and i live in houston i need something that's kind of matte so I'm gonna try this again. If this don't look come out right, I'm gonna go back with this. So we could just have a little chit chat while I'm putting on my makeup. Um, I'm 39 years old. I'll be 40. I'll be 40 in November. Um, I have a 19 year old who lives with my mom in Wisconsin because she just want to be grown. And don't want to listen to her mom and um you know being a mom is hard like it's really hard because you want you want your kids to do good but sometimes they just want to do things their way so you have to let them so that's what i'm struggling with um you know i love my kid but also i don't want to enable her i want her to be a good human being i want her to treat people right 
So like we have our little riff and rap because I'm my mom and I'm always gonna tell her what's right. Okay, we're gonna go in with the Got You Foundation. So other than that, I've just got married in October. Um, I've been with this, my husband. We've been together probably about 16, 17 years. We've been together a long time. And we just was like, didn't get married. And now we're married. We're happy. He have a 21-year-old. I have a 19-year-old. And we raised them together. Well, I really like this foundation. I'm going in with the e.l.f. concealer in Rich Cocoa. If you ha guys haven't tried this concealer, this concealer is game changing and it's only $7. I love e.l.f. products. I, I like this and I have it in deep chestnut too. I'm not doing too much of a beat today. I just want something a little natural today. Um, I've been working in the healthcare field since probably about... 2008 now i work as a therapist in a nurse i mean not a nurse home in the hospital and i see a lot you know i see a lot of stuff that makes me sad every day um i see how the healthcare field is going like you know it's not really about you as a person it's about what they can get out of you even their employees so it's just hard working in the healthcare field. Like, you know, I'm not as passionate about it as I used to be when I first started. Um, uh, but I guess that's life. Um, I like people who I work with. Um, me and my sister work together. Um, she's a therapist too. Um, I'm an assistant therapist. I was gonna go back to school for, but baby, um, um, my school closed down for being fraudulent and, um, they forgave me for $53,000 student loans. And I was, I, and the school I went to, they didn't, my credits couldn't transfer. So I had to start all over. So I had did probably about a year and a month. And when they forgave me my loans, I was like, you know what? I don't want no debt. So I quit that. And then, um, I was just like, let me try this YouTube thing and see how I like it. And I really like it. Um, more so, it's more about me getting comfortable with the camera and just being my authentic self. But I really love, I like watching people content. I like pe watching people vlogs. I like seeing women have confidence in themselves because I've struggled with confidence in myself for a long time, ever since I was a kid. Um, when I was a kid, I was really skinny. Like, and then when I had my daughter, I just pack on the weight, pack on the weight. And then I suffered from PCOS, where I gained my weight in my midsection. And I, like my arms, whenever I get bigger, my arms never grow, my legs never grow. Um, my legs never get bigger, and my arms don't get bigger. It go all to my stomach and my back. So I, I was really self-conscious about what I put on. And it was horrible. And that's not a way for nobody to live. I want, you know, I want to start my channel because I know I see a lot of people that shape like me who just not confident in themselves. And I just want to give them ideas of how to style themselves and feel confident and be comfortable in the skin that they're in. So, and I started working back out because I start to gain weight. And when I gain weight, you can really see it in my midsection because it don't go to none of to my hips, baby. I'm flat as a pancake in the back. So I just want to give women a little bit of confidence. I just want to give you a little idea about myself. 
I'm really laid back, cool, chill. Most people say I'm funny, but when I get on camera, they're like, why you don't present on the camera like you present to us? I was like, oh, no. So I'm starting to get a lot more comfortable with the camera. And I just want to give you a little bit into my life. I'm, I'm working a lot because I'm trying to purchase a house. And trying to purchase a house in Houston is so expensive. It really is. And we've been looking at houses and some of these houses, they want 250 k and you have to go in and strip everything. I'd rather have a new bill before I spend, spend that. And then I got to spend probably another 100 k to fix it the way I want. But that's just a little thing I'm going through right now. But um, I'm going to finish my makeup. And when I get done and get dressed, I'll show you my fit. Okay, this is our final look of our hair and makeup. And yes, these are real prescription glasses. I'm blind as a bat. And I'm going to step back and just show you my little cute casual outfit. Because when I'm shopping, I don't really like to wear too much. Because I got to change clothes too much. So I'm going to step back. I just got those denim shorts on. And I got this button up. And these jean shorts from Old Navy. And that is it for this look. I just got a packet from Fashion Nova. So I'm fed up. Open that and you can watch me open it up and see what I got. And I don't even remember what I ordered. So let's get into that. I'm back, y'all. And why nobody didn't tell me about Bath & Body Works Whip Body Butter? This is so good. I bought it on sale. I had never seen it before. I got the warm vanilla sugar. And also I got the Among the Clouds. And this smell really, really good. Okay. Here go our Fashion Nova bag. Let me see what we bought. All right. I think it's some camo jeans. I think that's what they are. Some wide leg camo jeans. Ugh. Okay. Let's open it up. Man, they you packed it for their life. So oh, it's two. I got these, what are they call? The Moto Cheek. Faux leather pants, and I got these in a size extra large. Let me stand up so you can see them. I think these are really, really cute. They're gonna be cute for the fall. Okay, let me see what else. I got another. Oops. All right. All right. Then I got these. They're called the Level You Up Camo Cargo Pants. And how cute are these? Oh, I can't wait to wear them. And I like that it got back pockets on it. Because you know I'm flat as a pancake back there. Okay. Fashion Nova. I got to try them on. So I'm going to put this in another haul. I'm going to style them up. So I can show you guys. So... I'm not going to do nothing right now. I'm um, just waiting on for the mall to open. Then I got to call the Uber so we can ride up there. So then we can start doing, try on some clothes. I need to go to Zara. I need to go to H&M. I need to go to Express. And have you guys ever shopped at Akira in the mall? Um, I normally shop online, but they 
just opened one in our mall so i want to try some few things on so i'm gonna take you along with the ride so talk to you guys later So I made it to the mall, probably about 15 minutes early before they open. I think I'm gonna head into Zara first and see what they got new in. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hey you guys, the first jean that I picked up was these high waist, double waistband jean. They retail for $89.90. These are in a size 12, but I would prefer to have a size 14. So it's a looser fit and it doesn't show how round my belly is. But I feel like these are really cute jeans that you can dress up or you can dress them down. And the next thing that I picked up to try on was this rip open knit sweater. This was in a size large. It's a bit oversized. So in order for it to fit me properly, I probably would have needed a medium. But I think this would be really cute for the fall. And how do you feel about this sweater? And the next thing I tried on was this asymmetric denim cape. It retailed for $89.90. I don't particularly care for it. I just wanted to um, try it out to show you guys. Um, so this is an option if you like this style. So what do you think about this? Let me tell you one thing about Zara, they do not hardly have any extra larges or XXL in a store. So that's why I hate going into Zara because they never have the bigger sizes in this Zara that is close by me. But now we're on our way to Express to see what they have in the store. Let's go.
So the first thing that I tried on was this denim shirt. It's heavy material and I love the detail on this shirt. I love the gold buttons. I picked it up in a size extra large. I probably could use a large. And then I tried on these mid-rise skyscraper um, denim, but it's not true denim. It's more of a stretchy material. I tried it on in a large and I didn't particularly care for it. Um, it has slits on the side, so you can probably only wear it with heels. But how do you feel about this look? I picked up this moto jacket in a size extra large. This retail for $198. And I wanted to try this moto jacket out because I like that it has gold hardware on it. And it's very rare that you see gold hardware on a black faux leather jacket and it's a little too big for me so um i try on a large and a large was too small in the waist so i had to leave it there at the store but i think this is a really cute option if you're looking for a new faux leather jacket express was a big bummer for me they really didn't have anything in there that I wanted um, um, the one thing that I like about that jacket is that it had gold buttons on it that's what I like about that jacket but it was paper thin you can get something with the better quality probably somewhere else for a lot cheaper because I think that jacket was like a hundred and ninety eight dollars so we're headed on our way to H&M to see what they got in store because they got a couple pieces online that I want to order, but I want to see if it's in store, but I didn't check on the app when I was looking. So let's go in there and see what they got. Then I got to give me something to eat. I am starving. this short cardigan sweater in a size extra large and I love this sweater you can wear it button or you can wear it unbuttoned and also I tried on these cargo pants with pockets it's only available in the stores not online um, I tried it on in a size 14 and I love them they have pockets on the side and you can wear this with tennis shoes or you can wear this with heel but i think this is really cute and then i tried on this turtleneck it's like a leopard print in the sides large i would need an extra large and then i also tried on this single breast blazer in a size medium it's too small in the back i would need a large but i think this is a really cute outfit that you can pair up with those cargo jeans And then I tried on this oversized pink sweater. It says love around you. It's not online. It might be in store only. And I think this is really cute with those cargo jeans. You can pair them up with tennis shoes. You can pair them up with heels. But I think this is a really cute casual look with a pop of color. So tell me how do you feel about this look? I liked that black and white sweater. 
Um, so I think I'm gonna get it, but I don't know. But I'm going to get me something to eat first and think about it before I make a purchase. But I am so hungry. And look at my hair in that fitting room, trying on these clothes. I thought it'd be better than a ponytail. It's just as frizzy. And I gotta figure out what am I gonna eat. I don't want no Chick-fil-A. Um, I gotta see what I'm gonna eat. Ugh. All right, let me figure out what I'm gonna eat and I'll check back in with you guys later. I think I'm gonna eat Charlie's Philly steak. I think I'm gonna get the bacon chipotle chicken cheese steak I have with some chicken and bacon fries and one of the lemonade, the strawberry lemonade. So, Hey, you guys, I made it back home. I'm going to end this vlog because I'm not going to do anything else the rest of the day. And I want to thank you for watching and tag along with me on my day off to just to see what my life consists of. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. Bye.